and Minister O'Gorman, just on the referendum, a lot of the criticism towards the Yes campaign in the CARE referendum this week, it seems like that criticism wouldn't be coming the campaign's way had the wording of the Citizens' Assembly been adopted. So I'm just wondering, are you start to feel, starting to feel like maybe that was a mistake? Um, look, government have discussed at length the referendum wording for the two proposals and have brought forward a very clear proposal in the CARE one, uh, um, a proposal that removes the outdated wording of Article 41.2 and brings in a new recognition of care, care in all its different forms, whether it's care of children, whether it's care of elderly parents or care of a, a family member with a disability, whether that care is carried out by men and women, because recognising it's really important that we support all family members in terms of care, but importantly changes the law in terms of placing a new legal onus, a new obligation on the state to, to support care with, uh, within families. So I think that's a very significant change. Um, I absolutely recognise there are people who would have, who would, who would have looked for a, a broader formatting, but we have an opportunity to remove outdated language and make that very significant insertion into our constitution, placing a new legal onus on the state, uh, and I think that's worth supporting and I'll be campaigning and I know across government we're vigorously campaigning for two yes votes on the 8th.